New Year from me and everyone at Race World TV. Andre Harrison back at it with another edition of the Top 5. And in this week's episode, I'm going to be discussing one of my favourite elements of F1. The liveries. Some of motorsport's most iconic shots have been captured by the very look of the cars themselves. How they work their sponsors, and how so many great designs ended up on your bedroom wall like mine did as a child. So, without further ado, here's my Top 5 favourite F1 liveries. At number 5, it's the Red Bull Racing Star Wars Special from Monaco in 2005. Haha, <laughs> topical reference. This was a very clever bit of co-promotion between George Lucas and Red Bull Racing, back when they were still the party animals of the F1 grid, in anticipation for the final Star Wars prequel movie, Revenge of the Sith. The less said about that movie, the better. Anyway, I have to commend Red Bull. They did a fair few of these kind of sponsor deals, including Superman. And when they did, they really went all in with George Lucas in Monaco, as well as the fantastic scene of the pit crew dressed in Stormtrooper-esque gear and Darth Vader holding the lollipop. Brilliant. Number four was kind of an inevitability. Who hasn't loved the Ferrari F1 livery at some point? I admit I'm being a little biased here as the very first F1 poster I owned as a child was of Michael Schumacher's Ferrari F1 2001, but of all the ones I've seen in my years of watching, the 2006 248 livery is my personal favourite. I like the Scarlet Red and the subtle black of the Marlboro logos. Well, before tobacco sponsorship got banned in F1 and it got covered in anime-style speed lines instead. No thanks. At number 3 is the early Arrows liveries of 2000 and 2001. Now another personal story here, but my dad actually used to do welding work for the team, so my house was often surrounded by free Arrows merch, so naturally I rooted for them in their back marker days. It only helped that their orange and black colour scheme and use of the or- orange mobile company sponsor complemented their car so well. One of my earliest memories of F1 was in 2001 in the infamous Monaco GP where Enrique Bernoldi was holding up David Coulthard and 8 year old me cheering the orange car on because of dad. That little bond is what made me put arrows here at number 3. Number 2 is the Jaguar team. There's just something extra cool about British racing green isn't it? And I just loved the green and white of the Jaguar team through the mid-2000s, my personal favourite being the 2003 version with the longer form HSBC logo and green being the slightly more dominant colour. An honourable mention here also has to go to the Lotus and Caterham teams of the 2010s. Didn't like the yellow so much, but they were pretty nice too. And my favourite ever F1 liveries belong to the more recent times of Jordan. The majority yellow and black worked really well with Benson and Hedges being their title sponsor and they always had brilliant, visually striking liveries. My personal favourite has to be the 2000 Jordan, with the shark fin on the sides of the nose, a fantastic design. I need to find that in canvas form and hang it on my bedroom wall already. So, what are your favourite F1 liveries and designs over the years? Sound off in the comment section below, and until next time, I've been Andre Harrison and thanks for watching. Oh, <laughs>